Well, happy things are coming up this year on CBS, not the least of which is our own friendly corner on the Gary Moore Show. Derwood, Carol, and Marion will be here along with the rest of the gang to bring you what we hope will be our brightest season on television. We hope you'll be here to enjoy all the great shows that spell excitement. And of course, uh, Red Skelton will be back. Red Skelton? Oh boy, he's for me. All right, Dad, I'll make the scene, but on one condition. What's that, baby? That you keep your cotton-picking hands off the TV set because I'm watching CBS this fall. Extraordinary sphere. Stray planet from the CBS galaxy, no doubt. Oh, we're looking forward to a new world of entertainment here on Wednesday night. A host of new stars will be in view for the first time this fall, along with some familiar luminaries. Let us meet your Wednesday hosts. Okay, Alvin? Alvin? Who else could it be but Alvin the Chipmunk? Yes, the mischievous singing Chipmunk and his brothers Simon and Theodore will make their debut on CBS television this fall with their creator and chaperone, David Seville. The brother known as Simon on the family tree And here's the star of the show Alvin! Great little group of stellar performers. Here's a young fellow who'll give you good reason why father knows best when it comes to moving. Robert Young will be holding open house at the Andersons' new Wednesday night address this fall. Wednesday night will also be a big night for Checkmate Incorporated. My young associates will be along with me to open our new offices on Wednesday night. The objective of our organization is to checkmate crimes before they happen. Just how we put this theory into practice is the tense hour long drama you'll see each week. Good luck, darling. And take care of yourself. I will, Mom. Bye. Oh, wait. I almost forgot. Bye. Well, Susan, so what can I say? Take good care of yourself. You too, Mom. And don't forget to write. I won't. Bye-bye. Here's one of the most charming stars you're likely to meet, this season or any season. Gertrude Berg stars in the role of a widow who enrolls in college as a freshman. Goodbye, <laughs> Find heartwarming comedy here as she tries to compete with her classmates and college counselor, Sir Cedric Hardwick. But it is my considered opinion the great abominations of mankind are war, famine, pestilence, and freshmen. And of course, you'll want to stay tuned to Wednesday's finest dramatic hour. Just entertainment on Wednesday night when you hitch your dial to the star's address here at CBS. Now, let's see if we can get an eye fix on Thursday night, hmm? You know, I, I never saw a fair without pretty girls, and I've never seen a pretty girl that didn't enjoy the television fair on CBS. Oh, there are great things coming to CBS Thursday this fall. A whole new evening of thrilling action shows will be coming your way, and it's going to be something, uh, something pretty special. Now, let me show you how the, uh, how the action shapes up on, on my new show, the, the Bob Cummings Show. <laughs> Seven o'clock? Uh-huh. In the morning? Sorry, boss, it's important. Lionel, nothing is important enough to justify getting up at seven o'clock in the morning. <laughs> with the possible exception of childbirth. Oh? 
And so since I'm not having a baby, would you kindly horizontal me and go away? Lionel, when I... Boss, it says this guy's only going to be in L.A. a couple of days. Yes, yes, I see what you mean, Lionel. Very well. Get in touch with this, uh, Mossman and tell him Bob Carson has information about his brother, the usual routine. Right. How's this for a quick change? Joe Wills and John Derrick will premiere Thursday night in a fast-moving hour from the frontier years. They'll be bringing you an exciting look at the Old West in Frontier Circus. the rest of us is going to have salt pork and beans now casey don't you go blaming me i'm not blaming anybody yet you folks stay away from this food don't touch any of it where'd you get this i opened a fresh mail this morning where right over there right now there's nothing in this world as important to me as the hunt the whole circus the lives of more than a hundred people depend on our getting fresh meat they're counting on me to find it That's only part of the new schedule. Now, let me introduce you to another big show that you'll be seeing for the first time this year. Here's the report the Canadian police met on the accident. They really it was just an accident. These are the investigators, a swift moving organization whose specialty is investigating insurance claims where criminal activity is suspected. No, no, this girl was pushed around all her life by her aunt, by the society set. All of a sudden the old witch falls down an elevator shaft. Look, I know this accident is fishy. Now look, Steve, the insurance money meant a new life for her. Maybe she wanted a new name to go with it. Then why didn't she stay here in New York and make a big splash of it? Spit in the eye of the people who snubbed her. But she's afraid somebody will catch up with her. By the way, every dollar of the insurance money has been accounted for. No unusual amounts paid out. Maybe that's why she had the accident. CBS reports will return on Thursday with a new series of hour-long presentations on the vital developments in the world today. The, the picture that spells fun and excitement on Thursday night this fall. Now, I, um, I understand that Rod Serling is here on the Midway someplace with a preview of Friday night. Won't you, uh, won't you join us, please? You know, they'd feel quite at home in the twilight zone. As a matter of fact, they're only a couple of hours away from the Twilight Zone. Friday nights, that is, on CBS television. Of course, they're a lot more active when they're raw-hiding their cattle drive along the Sedalia Trail. Now, the trail that these fellas take is considerably better paved, and they travel a lot faster. Chances are you'll never see them quite this relaxed on Route 66. Stay with the Friday night trail and it will lead you to the twilight zone. <laughs> 